Hello and welcome to this week's edition of the Engineering News and Mining Weekly magazine, published on Friday, 7 July 2023. In this week's cover article, Engineering News and Mining Weekly Senior Contributing Editor Online Darren Parker unpacks how grid capacity and skill shortages are hampering the renewables rollout. Grid capacity constraints and skill shortages have been highlighted by several renewable industry leaders as the primary issues that are holding South Africa back from overcoming the current energy crisis. The engineering news features focus on steel, where non-competitiveness and non-use plague the South African steel industry. Water engineering, infrastructure and reservoirs, where urbanization is placing pressure on water infrastructure. Business in KwaZulu-Natal, where the Trade Expo Kite 2023 promises to be bigger and better. And testing, inspection and certification services, where enforcing measurable objectives can ensure quality products. The Mining Weekly features focus on pumps, where processing plants should upgrade pumps first when increasing their minerals processing throughput. This week's business leader is Greg Maslov, co-CEO of SAPRO. And as this week's cartoon shows, in the years preceding the start of the load shedding crisis in 2007, electricity commentators would regularly warn that the distribution sector was emerging as South Africa's weakest link. Distribution level faults are now causing more disruption to business and households than load shedding. We hope you enjoy this edition of Crema Media's Engineering News and Mining Weekly. Be sure to subscribe to the magazine that offers you in-depth news about developments in the real economy by emailing subscriptions at engineeringnews.co.za. Happy reading and see you next time.